In this video, I'm gonna share with you how to scrape product information from Amazon without any code and so easy that even your dog can do it. First off, let me introduce the secret sauce of this operation, Magical. Magical is a productivity tool that makes a technical task, well, non-technical. You won't require any code, APIs, or integrations to get it going. It's a handy Chrome extension that you can install on your browser that's gonna help us scrape the data from Amazon and it's absolutely free. To install Magical, simply click the link in the description and pin it to your extension tab for easy access. Okay, so maybe you can relate to leaving countless products in your cart just so you can return to them later because these pesky wishlist feature is hard to find. I know it is for me. What we're going to do is create our own wishlist instead. And first I'm gonna find all the products that I'm interested in purchasing and open them in several tabs. So as you can see, I'm currently looking at a number of gifts for my girlfriend as her birthday is coming up soon. I have each product open in different tabs as you can see and if I were to navigate through any of these tabs, you'd see that there is a number of information and data provided on this page. To scrape the material and to scrape the data from this page, I'm gonna activate Magical by clicking on the extension up in the right-hand bar here. And immediately, Magical is gonna scrape all of this good data into the database. And so now, I can simply navigate and see what is there. So there's a lot of good information in here that I can use so that when I put it into my list, I can make you know an informed decision. Let's say I wanted to add additional data that is not highlighted here in my database. So for this use case, what I'm gonna do is look for something that I can edit. So I see that the operating system is not clearly highlighted. So I can all rename this, or what I can do is click on this add more function, and you'll notice that it is uh, activated because there is a blue border around the page, which means that I can now hover over different text items to add it into the database. So I'm gonna add this iOS here. And once I click on it, I can now type in operating system and create that label. Now what I can do is click on save and it's going to add it into my database so that I have that information. Now the thing to note is that all products are going to have different types of categories and information. So not everything is going to be labeled under the same tabs or the same header once I transfer it into a Google Sheet. Once I'm done labeling the item, I'm gonna click on done. And as you can see, the blue border is no longer there. And now I can go to other tabs and highlight different information as I see fit, just by activating that tab in the top right-hand corner in the extension bar. Now, I think Amazon and Magical play along well, so I should be able to kind of transfer everything at this point in time. So what I'm gonna do is click on transfer to and now I can either add it to a new spreadsheet or to an existing one. I already have one for my birthday wish list, but for the sake of this video, I'm actually going to create a new one. So I'm gonna click a new spreadsheet, and there you see the option to either transfer just this tab or transfer all tabs. So to save time, just because we are all about productivity and efficiency, I'm gonna click on all tabs. Okay, so fantastic. Magical has successfully taken all the information from those tabs and inputted it into a Google Sheet. There was some other information that was not relevant to what I want for my wish list, so I removed that and I left what was necessary for me to make an informed decision. So as you can see, we have the name of the products, the URL, which is important. You can go back to them when you want to make your purchase and add them to your cart. I also have an about, a price, review, rating, and the brand. And so I can go about and format this Google Sheet if I wanted to. I can expand this out just a little bit, which I tend to do most times, just so I have a little bit more space. And let's say you wanted to get more information about the product, you could go ahead and format it to wrap. Okay, just a couple of tips here that you may want to use for your own particular use case. And so now I have a wish list without having to go into my Amazon profile and look for all these products and open it in new tabs. I have all my information lined up here just so I can see it. So if you wanna have an effective scraper to scrape Amazon information into Google Sheets, Magical is a tool for you. So whether you're an average consumer, an enthusiastic blogger, or just a productivity junkie, Magical is a secret ingredient you didn't know you needed. With Magical, you're not just saving precious time, but you're unlocking a whole new level of efficiency. And if this sounds too good to be true, well, seeing is believing. So go ahead and give it a crack. The link is in the description. As always, stay curious, stay connected, and stay magical. Until next time, folks, happy scraping.